I respect almost every player that I play against. We'll play a game. I'll say something, and you tell me the first thing that comes to your mind. Short, huh? Okay. okay, Don Nelson. Great coach. Magic Johnson. The best. Mullen. Mullen dropping the ball. Mullen's first name is Chris out of St. John's. He's blindsided by Green. The ball is bounced loose. Mullen got to the face. Turn, shoot, make a 17-footer left hand. Nice shot to Richmond. Over the left side to Mullen. Boy, I'm proud of that guy. A jumper by Mullen. That's good from 22. Mullen with the ball. The referee should, too. Left hand jumper. Now to Mullen. Mullen in front of the key. Pump bait. Can't shoot. Double team. Feeds under the ball. Heel has over two steals the game. Here he comes. Here comes Coop. Mullen scores underneath by crossing under the basket. Mullen drives on Coop to the base. Stop. Pump bait. Loses Coop. His two-pointer from 21 is good. Nice shot. That gives him 22. Coop to the base. That's that ball away. 17-footer. That's good. Taken by Mullen on an eighth. Blocked by Kareem. Great play by Kareem. Three ball to Mullen. Score! Mullen got the second effort. He's got 26. He's you know, your body body mechanics mm -hmm. uh, between your hips and, and your arms and the length of your arms. Um, but I don't think there's any you know, exact way you need to be lined up. A lot of guys was frustrated by him because they they didn't really know how to guard him. Anytime the ball touched his hand, it was gone, and it was mostly good. And there's nothing <laughs> you can do about that as a defensive player. Mullen, through the leg, through McDaniel, through the hoop. They're going wild. Mullen, five years in a row, he's averaging 25 points a game, which for the Warriors hadn't been done since Will Chamberlain. That was outrageous. Averaging 26 points a game, shooting 50%, shooting 80, almost 89% of your free throws. Well, I think uh, it's something I think all the work I put in this summer is, is paying off now. His passing was underrated. He could move the ball. He was always thinking a step ahead. Mullen off to the races. Look out with Drexler. Passes it to the trailer. If you or I were to race him in a foot race, we'd have a shot. Here goes Mullen. They would measure your vertical or my vertical jump compared to Chris Mullins. We'd have a shot. Mullen with a difficult shot. When God made a basketball player, he just carved Chris Mullen out and just said, this is a player. When he signed to go to St. John's, it took him from you know, a great local story to all of a sudden in position to be a national champ. Mullen again makes it look easy. You've got to guard Chris Mullen. Went to the Cossack Arena, and Chris and there were about five or six of us were playing basketball. We go outside, and it's a huge snowstorm. I came back three days later, he was still there. He just stayed in the gym the whole time. He developed into a great, great all-around player. See, that's the thing. He played the whole game. The good ones do things for themselves, the great ones do things for others. And he made everybody around him better. To watch the university light up, to watch the city light up, to watch the Empire State Building colored in red and white because of Chris Mullen. They didn't just embrace him as a basketball player, but they embraced him as one of their own. High school, and we played an exhibition game against Zavarian, and he came in and had 39 and two quarters. 37 for Mullen. Here goes Mullen, draws the crowd all the way to the basket, got it! One point three to go! What a remarkable play by Mullen! The strength of his game was his 18, 20 foot jump shot. 20 foot jumper, you know he'll make that. And his ability to get open. Absolutely amazing. If you left him open, you could just run back down the court because it was going in. Chris was a machine of a scorer. Here's Mullen. Oh, he is on. You had to watch him at all times because he was an unbelievable outside shooter with tremendous range. What a shot. Chris Mullen just picked his pocket. Oh, brother, what a play. If they were to measure his basketball IQ to yours or mine, we would have no shot whatsoever. Chris Mullen was a very smart guy on the court, very smart. He's like Larry Bird. Now, Chris Mullen used to, you know, he used to have the smoothest jump shots and lefty. And I mean, he had to sit there and snap and pop, boom. He had a knack for getting the ball in the hole. Nearly stolen by Mullen, disrupting things, stolen by Hurley ahead. Less than a second, go! What a play by Mullen! 
This guy was on the original Dream Team. There was a reason he was on that team. And, you know, guys like Michael Jordan and Magic Johnson, they had a lot to do with picking that team. You know they want to get the ball to Mullen, don't you? Wouldn't you? He dribbles, he stops, he shoots over Magic from 21. And oh, he hit him on a 30-footer. Mullen, the greatest outside shooting exhibition I've seen in years, maybe ever. We would be playing defense, man, and we'd bust our butt in. I think I am the only one down court. Tim would throw it to me, and I'm like, I'm getting ready to dunk. And I look down, somebody said, Phew. It'd be Chris up under the ball. Like, How the heck did he get down there so quick? <laughs> Your man didn't shoot the ball. He on the other side. How did you get down there? The I mean, other, he the other would, guy contested. He would leak out. Oh, we called the leak out. He was the best leak outer in the world. Huh? Hey, he was always down the court. Always. Always. <laughs> He'd be oh up under the basket, he'd get a rebound, get he'd kick it out to you. Next thing you know, he'd like, hey, I'm ready. Like, no, how you get down here that quick? You're not that fast. Exactly. <laughs> how did you get down here? Uh, it was he ready, he always ready. He's always ready. The blue eyes so brother of all blue eyes so brother. This is the Eminem of professional basketball. He's the guy who can bury a shot if you're not on it. This is Mullen with five, looking for three. Got it. Oh, brother. He still has the ability to make shots. They lost to a better team in Los Angeles. This was a guy starting out as a freshman in St. John's until when he ended, had an unbelievable career. Everything going for Chris Mullen. Chris was a hard-nosed guy from St. John's who only played one way. Draws the crowd all the way to the basket. Got it! Chris could go down in NBA history as one of the best perimeter shooters to ever play the game. A three by Chris Mullen. Very special player. As a tremendous teammate, a guy who passed the ball, who plays the game as they say the right way. And it's kind of the New York way. There's a lot of teamwork involved. So he's thought very highly of If I had not met Chris Mullen or played with him, I would not be a professional basketball player. He taught me how to go into the gym and work on your craft. And I'm going to be a guy with tears in my eyes as a way to say to him, thank you because he made me believe also. He belongs up there with all the great players. He does, there's no doubt in my mind. Because I think he's the consummate player. And I don't think anybody loved the game more than he did. Open, good again. Michael with 10, Mullen reverse layup. The folks thought he walked. Mullen, good again. Yeah, absolutely, he hit it right in the head. Spin underhand and it's good. Scotty right there on Mullen. Fade away. Oh, that's so tough. Mullen fakes, fade away. Got it. At the buzzer. Chris Mullen hits it. The Mullen. And there is all kinds of pushing and shoving going on. Mullen got it and he's fouled. You talk about deceptively slow, and that's what he is. He makes his move, takes a long step, looks for an arm reaching out, makes the contact, and Stacy King on the foul. Here he comes through, looking for a little room. There it is, makes the bump and lays it up. Nobody by Mullen. Nobody by Mullen. Get a, get a timeout. You need him. And he called it. Leading scores for both teams with 32 to 8. Just inside the three-point line. Just Mullen open, right baseline. Good again. Michael on the drive. On top, and Mullen there. And they almost throw it away. But Mullen gets it and lays it in. Cliff Levingston with a final shot. It misses. And the Golden State Warriors have done what's been very tough to do. Come to Chicago Stadium and get a win.